Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to part 10 of Let's Play Mario 64. So, last time you were here with me, I had just collected my 76th star, nabbed it off of Toad. He's pretty small. I had to pry it from him, but, you know, it went alright. So yeah, and we are returning to this ice level, whatever the fuck it's called. I do have one more star to get from downstairs, which is in the Bowser's sub-level. Which is the collect 100 coins one, hence why I'm not doing it. And frankly, I don't want to waste the time going down there. You know, I've only got so long to collect stars and that in these parts. You know, because it's sort of, you know, due to timing it 20 minutes or whatever like that. You know, a bit of an arbitrary rule, but whatever. It seems to be working so far. And yeah. So I'm going to wait until I've got a reason to go downstairs first. Like, if I exit screen in one of these games and go back to the is it foyer, lobby, center of the castle, anyways, what I call it. And yeah. If I do that, then I'll go down and get the 100 coin one. So yeah, until then, I'm going to try and get the rest of the stars from this level. And I will have to get the 100 coin one from here soon, which won't be too hard. Because there's an igloo that I got going there. From what I remember, if I'm remembering correctly, there's a shitload of stars in that. Rings. Not a, fuck, not even rings. You know, coins. There's a shitload of coins in that, so getting 100 coins on this level shouldn't be too hard. Then it never should be. So yeah, who's that climbing on me? Blah blah blah, yeah, he's gonna start blowing his breath. Uh, if you've been following along, you've seen that I've already got blasted by that fucker, and it knocks your hat clean off, which makes you take double damage, which you got to see as well. So yeah, I'm playing it nice and safe, I'm not gonna do anything adventurous, I'm just gonna wait for this guy. And then stand on it, oh, get the fuck on his head. There we go, just stand on it, let him run past, I'm gonna wait for him to get clean to the other side. Because as I've said before, it is late here now, and whatever, now is not the time for adventurous styles of gameplay. Especially when you're coming up on two thirds done. So yeah, I've got by there. That's good. And 77. Here we go. Ugh. Yep, that's good. Don't take your half now, man. Don't want you losing it. And back in we go. Right. Well, from the freezing pond. Right now. That is what I've been struggling with every other time I've come in here. For some reason, I have fucked it up repeatedly. Repeatedly? Yeah, why not? Repeatedly. Every time. So badly. All I've got to do is jump on him, land on the other one, and then I'm good. Oh dear. And it looks like it's going to be a repetitive of before. And yeah, I cannot jump on him from here. I cannot just, you know, jump up to him in the water. What I'll try to do. I don't know why I'm struggling with it so much. Normally I just launch at it, but now I'm more self-conscious and thinking about it and, and bouncing into fuck all. Bouncing into absolutely nothing. Yeah, this isn't working out. I'm about to die. I do not want to die like that. Right, let's go find some coins. Heal my health a bit and come back and try again. Good, good. Yeah, nearly back to full. There we go, full health. Right. So yeah, I don't know why I'm fucking it up so much. I'm sort of just drawing a blank looking at it. Why the hell can't I jump over there? Hmm. If I can lure him. Nah, that's not gonna work. I'm drowning as is. Yeah, I... I really don't know what's going on there. Must have been more stressful day than I thought. Which sounds very dramatic, you know, you guys don't know what's been going on, and frankly, I'm not gonna tell you. Pretty personal stuff. So, I'm sorry about that, but, you know. There we go. What you do have to know is it's made me a terrible gamer. That's... For no reason, that's what's happened. Right. Get me blown down here. No problem. I'll put up with that. Um... Yeah, I just wonder what I do. Probably just go in the igloo and get that star or something. If I can remember where it is. It's around here somewhere. You need the shell for that, I think. Or you're supposed to. I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna do this. Oh. This is so bad. This is unbelievably bad. Alright, I think I can get up there. Depends. Yeah. 
expecting the triple jump, but alright. Yeah. And then drop down from above into that igloo. I don't I don't think you quite saw it. Maybe. Just a little passageway up there. I think I gotta get over this guy. Yeah, 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 we know what you're in for. We need to hear it again, mate. Fuck. Yep, the bad gameplay is working its way back in. That's alright, pick up my hat. And carry on. Here we go. I think I can get around that from here. Oh. Where's the fucker? Right. <laughs> I jumped before he appeared as well, didn't I? I'm pretty certain I have. So he's come out of nowhere just to fuck me up. Right, okay. I'm gonna do this. Land on him. Well, I did. I wonder I'm struggling if that's what's gonna happen. You know what? Screw it. I am gonna go finish the other course. Well, that's been a waste. Blind me. I swear I'm half decent at this. I wouldn't go as far as saying good. But, you know. Reasonable? Above average. Nah, no, probably not. Depends what you mean average as. If you mean someone that just generally plays video games, then yeah, above average. If you mean the standard you see on YouTube from a lot of people, then definitely, definitely not. Right, any of the ones except for Bald Bowser suck, because that'll make it lag like fuck every time I go down there. Right, first of all, we got to collect rings. So, I'll go along the bottom here, nab whatever I can, try to avoid getting hit by the manta ray, blah blah blah. And then I've got to make sure to get that set at the top, which is tricky, because I don't know quite where they are, just that they won't render until I get up close. So anyway, I've got to get these without getting sucked into the whirlpool. Shouldn't be too hard. And that set over there, again, shouldn't be too hard. Might as well get that set there while I'm at as well. Uh-huh. Get the fuck off shot. What the hell? You looked angry. Right, now this one, and back out. Now, I know there's a couple of batches of five rings in like a straight line, or maybe just one, I'm not sure. I think there is. Yeah, and that one's pretty fucking close to the whirlpool. Right, okay. See, I think the trick here will be let it pull me and, you know, let it pull me into the coins. Do I keep pulling them rings? Can't help it. Come on, quickie, you prick. There we go. Right, I think that's all the ones down there. That's just to find the ones at the top. And are they along here? No. Yeah, I think it makes it hard to render because you got the water and a lot to worry about. Didn't struggle with the ones down the bottom. Oh, your guess is as good as mine. But they seem fairly well hidden, even though they're not hidden. They're not there. Big ass long stretch. Yeah, here somewhere, I think. So no along here. Oh god, it's gonna be another part like that. I just know it. Yeah, I'm certain I'm gonna be here. Oh. Let's keep looking about. I really don't want to have to just circle around the entire outside. But I think that's what I'm gonna... Oh, there they are. That ain't too bad. Didn't take too long. Right, okay. You keep pressing B to try to stop, he doesn't. He just tries to catch. Yep, down we go. On to the next bit. Get the fuck out the way. Yep. I'll try to swim quicker. I've just been mashing the A button nervously the whole damn time. Get some air. Air is always good. And then we're into the next bit. And there's plenty down the bottom here, I think. And then there's a shell, which... I'll grab the shell just so you can see why I don't bother grabbing them most of the time. They fucking suck. There's nothing in these, either. I think it's just the one on the end. Anyway, I'll grab these. Not only so I avoid choking to death underwater, suffocating. But yeah, 
50. That's good. Half done. Ooh, that ain't good. Yeah, come on, I'm gonna grab the shell. I said I was gonna, and I'm gonna. There we go. Oh, that looks good. You know, nice speed and everything. It's all good. Blah, blah, blah. Doesn't take long, however. See? Wears off. I didn't press nothing, it just wears off like that, which seems like the biggest fucking waste of time in history to me. Outside of part 7 of this Let's Play Mario 64, but, you know. Right, I'm gonna go up. Cause yeah, there's 30 in a, you know, that blue switch. I think you get 30 coins from that. And if I had all the red ones in, that would take me nearly to 100. So what I'll do is find a few more and be done. So, yay! Anyway. Here we go. To wait for the next one to come. Or not. Just be a kind of long jump off of it. That way I wouldn't have to wait. Come on. Right, off we go. Come on. Whoops. So busy trying to satisfy the aching in my poor trapezius muscles. I forgot to jump. To my mind on the game. Yeah. And down we go. Whoops. Yeah, 30. That's good. Plenty. Alright, this will take us up to 90. should carry on by the way I came actually. I was debating going in the water and starting again, but it'll take a lot longer. There we go. Ah yeah. Mm -hmm. Most of the way back. And then I'll just have to remember where the last few coins are. Like I say, it's pretty tight on this level. It makes you basically get every single coin. Which is a dick move. But, you know, games are meant to be full of dick moves, they're meant to trip you up. Again, I'll get this one first, and hop over there, get the others, now I'll probably just drop in the water. Because they're probably in the water anyway. Seven. And eight, that's all the red coins. Let's drop down. And yeah, I'm probably around here somewhere. I really don't know. I'll check along the rest of the, uh, you know, outskirts. A bit that isn't water here. And we'll see. Probably in a box or something stupid. Just waiting for it. Oh, there we go. And yeah, I think if I get that other one, might as well. That's every coin in this level. It really makes you earn it. Here we go! Yep, that's all good. Yeah, okay. Exit course. And now, I think to look through. Blah, blah, blah. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Yeah. Up to level nine, that's everything. The snowman's line is level ten, but I don't feel like going back to that. Not yet. For some reason, jumping on an enemy seems to have me completely stumped. Don't want to do that water level yet, neither. It takes forever, that's all. Ooh, nope. I went to the ice level. That was stupid. This one. It's the only painting in the game that doesn't look like a level. A level entrance, should I say. Anyway, so yeah, I got... Ooh, just noticed the cursor's in the way. I don't know if it's picking that up. Shouldn't be. But yeah. Take this shortcut here. So yeah, scale the mountain. Oh, I'll just get the top. Easy, right? Should be. Nope, not interested in monkeys or kennies today. Ugh. I think he nicks your hat, I'm not sure though. I'll probably jump to that one from here, but I'm gonna play it safe. I'm just gonna do the mission one for now. Nothing exotic or fancy needed. Just get through, do the mission. Yep. Out of the way, Gumbo's on the man on a mission. Please don't fuck up. Yeah, we're good. Can't remember if that cloud can blow you off or not. It's been a while since I've been here. Long time. 
Yep. Right, take it a bit slower here. Just for the hell of it. I mean, it's not that thin that you can't run across it, but... Like I say, I'm feeling a bit... Delicate. No need for risky, you know, maneuvers or whatever. Just... Very cool. Like I always say, but never do. Very cool, go casual, get all the stuff. Here we go. What this time? Oh, she's back up. You wanna go back up and catch a monkey? He's a bit fiddly. But if you've seen my adventures with the uh, rabbits, hares, I don't know, the ones in the basement that run about. The yellow guy with the big A. Uh, big A? Not that. The big ears. And yeah, it's not that monkey we gotta catch. He does fuck well. I'm starting to get tired of invisible walls that I'm smashing my face into. Hmm. Because it, it, if it's just a glitch that's there, it's one thing. But it seems to vary whether it's there or not. The game has to decide it's in the mood to fuck you over like that. Oh well. That's fine. Do your worst game. If I can't beat you at your best, then I don't deserve to beat you. Why is it worst? I don't know. It depends on the perspective. From the game's perspective, it will be doing its best to try to stop me. From my perspective, it will be doing its worst because it's succeeding. So, make of that what you will. Anyway, leave over again. Too easy. No invisible walls to fuck me up now. Ah, uh ah. -huh. Yeah, I can jump up from here, actually. I'll give it a go. Yeah. First time I've done that. Right, now, again, this guy's fiddly. I swear, he is. Not just me playing like a dildo. Hmm, now he's gonna instantly leap out the way. I he only leaps when you jump out him like the wall, I think. I'll get him eventually. Take the nipball down. Yeah. Again, there's no real trick to him, you just sort of catch him. I know I'm getting way quicker than this. With Mario's massive, kill on my hands. Ooh, that was close. Hmm. Whoops. Come on. Please don't let this monkey make a monkey out of me. Sounds like time for a Markiplier song. Yeah, I'm feeling a bit non-fabulous at the moment. So he's kind of got me. Fucking hell. Ah, come away. Ah, relax. Breathe deep. And let's go get this fucker. Oh, nearly had him. Wow, would have done. Fuck you, you little bitch. <laughs> oh man, I'm doing so bad. Yeah, I can't. Oh, there we go. Not the most dramatic way to catch him, but I've got him. I'll tell you what, let's trade. Let me go, I'll give you something really good. Now, he is legit, but I really don't want to let him go. Eh, yeah, alright. I suppose I'm better off getting the star than chucking him off the edge and, you know, being really pleased with myself while still not having the star. Oh well. Maybe I'll come back and chuck him off the edge. I'll get the star first. Or maybe I'll chuck him off the edge after. I don't know. Anyway, hee 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 hee. Didn't really need to read us that, did it? There you go. Yes, yes, yes. Let me get the damn star ready. And the monkey's gone. This is probably good, otherwise we'd have spent the next few minutes just trying to grab him and throw him off the edge. Here we go! I will. I will have to do that. Just to prove I can catch him fairly quick. Anyway, I'll see if I nab another star quick. So, scary shrooms, red coins. Nah, not doing that. Nope, 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 nope. Not a better idea. Let's see if I can pull it off. Here we go! 
<laughs> yeah, you see that mushroom down there at the bottom right? I'm gonna try and launch myself onto that from a distance. No, it's that one that I want. I don't know if I can make that. Slide up. You can. There we go. Set the star nice and quick. Maybe that kind of makes up for fucking up with the monkeys over there. Plus to the lonely mushroom. Anyway, I think I better leave that there for this part. So, a bit of a slow one, but we're getting there. We're over two thirds of the way there now. So, yeah. Hope to see you guys in the next part. I hope you've enjoyed this. Thanks very much for watching. Catch you in the next bit. Bye.